Hey YouTube, how the fuck you doing guys? Welcome back to episode 3 of our Minecraft survival series, Surviving in the Man of Sand. I really need to stop saying that, but who cares? I'm just giving you guys an introduction, right? And I know before we even turn to the house, as you can see, like, you know, a lot of cosmetic work has happened. Let's go ahead and take a little walk to the beach. And I'm going to tell you guys, many of you have been wondering why the hell I haven't been posted for the last, like, two weeks or so, maybe relatively close to two weeks um actually as a matter of fact where's do I have a shovel with me no I do not so I, I cannot I was gonna mine for the for the sand over there but it doesn't matter I'm just gonna kill sheep gather wood wool and I'll probably make my floor white or something but yeah you guys have been wondering why I haven't been posting videos for the past I think about a week or two and I did run into some big, big problems with my recording software. For some reason, uh, Fraps wouldn't pick up my uh, my microphone. So, and I needed to get that fixed because I don't want to record and then do a um, over commentary over the video in like Sony Vegas or something. I just wanted to be all live commentary so you guys can get to enjoy the recording in the moment. Why are they all coming toward me? You know you're gonna die, buddy. I'm sorry. I have to I have to collect wool. Did I I gotta get these XP grinders. Um yeah, Fraps wouldn't like completely just ignored my microphone <clears throat> no matter what, excuse me. No matter what I tried. Um but I finally got it fixed. It's working out perfectly as you can hear. Uh, everything's being recorded fine. Um you know my computer's just been bugging out. I don't know if it was actually Fraps or just my computer wasn't even picking up my uh my microphone at the moment. So I got that I got that sorted out. I'm going to be posting a lot this week, a lot more episodes. I'm trying to record as many as I can, so just in case if I, you know, go MIA again for a little bit, you guys um, will still have videos to watch. Um, I also want to give a big, big shout out to BazingaBoy1000, and he has his own YouTube channel. I'll link it to the description below um, because he just completely motivated me and inspired me to uh, continue making these videos for you guys because um, the videos have been doing awesome like way better than I expected them to do I was expecting like three views maximum for like a week but they've been doing awesome I've already gotten to like 20 views in the past two videos both of them actually and I'm just very 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 thankful for it for everybody who watches them everybody who likes them um, Bazinga Boy especially because he's been telling me you know he loves watching the episodes and he loves uh, just being able to uh, watch me do this and you know I, I just want to say thank you so much for actually watching my videos and posting that kind of feedback because it helps me know what people enjoy watching me do or watch on YouTube in general so um, you know that I thank you so much for letting me know that you just enjoy watching the videos in general and I'll, I don't know most definitely continue making these videos so we're back on episode 3 I don't know if I said episode four, episode five, but I'm I might I must be blanking out. But we're on episode three, and the house, big 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 changes to the house here. Let me get a little better view of how it looks. I mean, look at that. I did some extra 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 cosmetic work to the house, and I'll show you the interior in a second. But I went ahead and added this little section over here, and this leads to our mine shaft, which I'll show you inside the house in a second. And this is our bedroom, and the benefit of this is because if I go to bed now. I won't spawn outside of the house like I was telling you guys in the episode before. I also went ahead and extended the house completely. Extended the farm. I think I'm gonna extend the farm down a little bit. Grew some new. I'm um, growing some new, some new wheat, some more wheat, so I can have enough food to eat. Um, but the, but the design of the house is pretty much inspired from a Native American longhouse. I've I've done some studies lately on Native Americans and the way they lived, and I just I I admire the way they built their houses. And here's Here's what I modeled them off. Um, you know, I'm just gonna go ahead and go inside without any more jibber jabber. I'm gonna go ahead inside and show you guys how it looks. Now, nothing has changed pretty much. I just spaced things out. The furnaces were much, much closer to the door. I moved them up a little bit. Uh, the chest was also closer to the door. I moved that up. Crafting table. Everything's just been spaced out so I have more room to move around and more room to access things individually. Uh, and also have. Where are they? Pretty sure I put. Yeah, there it is. I collected iron, um, and also the bedroom has its own chest, so I can put like armor and stuff in there. Yeah, I just want to make it look neater 
so that's why I went ahead and did that. Um, put some 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 doors over here, leading to the farm. We'll definitely be expanding the farm in future episodes, so you know, stay tuned for that because I want to be able to start domesticating animals, so we wouldn't have to go outside and hunt for them. Or could just go ahead and you know, feed pigs, carrots, or whatever they eat, and they could spawn in babies, and I could kill the parents. Yeah, I know that's messed up, but you know, we get, we gotta do what it means to survive. So someday, piggies, someday I will get you. Anyway, let's go down to the mine shaft. Now, yeah, a lot, a lot. I've done a lot in the past few weeks or whatever that I haven't posted a video. And, and again, I apologize for that phone call. All right, sorry, I had to pick up that phone call, so I had to pause the video there for a second. Um, yeah, like I, I was apologizing. I think that's what I was saying. I was apologizing for not posting a video for like a week, but I was also outside of it YouTube I've, I was trying to expand as much as I can trying to cover as much so next time when I record everything works perfectly I have a lot more to show you guys and a lot more to talk about so again I started the mine shaft it looks awesome I put torches everywhere I mean it's evenly spaced out and things of that nature I also put a uh, chest here and a crafting table so just in case if I find something good I don't have to go all the way back upstairs to like put those stuff away and then come back down and continue mining so I build a quick chest over here and a crafting table to build things that I need um, let's just go ahead and go even further down here and I've actually mined all the way Ooh, how did I miss these last time iron 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 is life guys iron is life adjusting my screen real quick here um, but yeah I've mined all the way to level 12 as we all know I, I I do my research to this guys. I don't I don't just do it willy nilly. Um, people say that level twelve is basically mining heaven. Like you can find pretty much everything on level twelve, including diamonds and a lot more iron. And as you can see, let me pull it up right here. We are on level twelve. This is level twelve, and I continue mining down that way, picking up some more iron. I have to. So I can make better tools and hopefully armor, uh, better armor. Um, but yeah, this is level 12. So I'm hoping in some direction that I mine, I mean, clearly I'll be mining this way, and I haven't found anything. I haven't found any diamonds, any, any, any besides iron. I haven't found pretty much anything else. And um, I'm hoping to find diamonds as I keep mining down this way. But so far I've found nothing. And there's a bigger, actually a bigger tunnel in there that I actually found. I didn't mine it. I found it down there and I put torches all around to keep from to keep mobs from spawning down there and surprising me when I go back down there. And surprisingly I didn't find any creepers or anything like that down there. Like it was completely empty, but I did find a lot of good things. I don't know what that is, actually. I haven't researched that. Somebody tell me in the comments below what that blue thing is. I know the red one is uh redstone obviously, but I don't know what that blue stuff is. Um and I honestly haven't seen anybody on YouTube encounter it so far, but uh Hopefully somebody in the comments can tell me what that stuff is so and what what I can use it for. If it's actually a necessity. Yeah, but pretty much I've mine all the way down here to this point. Right, you can see we got some redstone right there. But that's not what I wanted to show you guys. What I wanted to show you guys, if I can fix this up real quick so it looks even better, is up here. Now this is a humongous tunnel going down this way. Um, there's literally, I put torches, like I said before, around here. Uh, there's, again, that blue block or whatever the hell it's, it, it, I can use it for. I found a whole bunch of coal down here, and the tunnel splits up over here to right and left. So, I, again, I put torches all around here. Um, iron, I'm going to come back and take that. And this is where the left side ends. The right side is actually even longer. I'm going to go ahead and take this iron. And I think there's more in the by the doorway there. I, I might have forgotten to show you guys those, but there's a lot of iron down here, and this is gonna be very very useful to creating again more tools, um, better armor, things of that nature. If I can get out of here. Um, and tunnel two leads this way. Uh, again, it's just more a lot more coal, a lot more iron. I've, I found more iron in this spot than I've done in the whole series combined which is awesome and then there's lava over here um, should probably I'm not percent sure excuse me for that noise somebody's just moving stuff around my uh, recording um, but yeah there's coal over there which I should pretty much start mining and remove that so you guys can see better um, but yeah there's a lot of stuff on this level and this is just level what this is level 
Level 44. No, level 31. What am I talking about? I'm X X44. Y is the up and down. So this is level 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 31, and there's a lot of stuff over here. So I'm gonna go ahead and mine all this coal. I'm gonna need all this coal so I can burn stuff better. I mean, I know that you can also use wood, but oh, I almost got burnt. If that lava spewed down here, I would have been a goner. I know you can also use um, wooden blocks, but there's really no point because wooden blocks also take longer and it, t it takes a lot more of them to actually be able to cook something in the furnace. So that's why I'm just using, um, I'm going to use just regular coal. Um, but yeah, I can be able to, uh, you know, melt, smelt iron. I like to say smelt, not melt, smelt iron. I can also be able to, j I can use coal for just better things. It cooks faster. I can use less of it to cook stuff. So coal just, you know, the fossil fuels. I know, I know my, my, I, I've studied my rocks, earth, uh, rocks and minerals. Uh, so these are fossil fuels, right? I think, I think they're fossil fuels. I'm not 100% sure actually. <laughs> but yeah, um, you know, this is pretty much the jackpot right here all this coal very very useful stuff if you ever had to decide between using coal and and wooden blocks go for the coal can use less of it to cook and smelt more things and it's just there's a lot more of it I mean yeah there's more trees and you can replant trees and you can't replant coal but you know coal is just it's just better uh oh do I have another one? No, I do not. That's gonna suck. Now I have to go back upstairs. But yeah, I'll, I'll actually do this off camera. I'll come back down here and uh, is this the right way out? Yeah, I'll come back down here and I actually gotta eat. I'll come back down here to get more uh, more of this coal and iron and stuff like that, and I'll put them away or melt them or whatever. But somebody has to tell me what this blue stuff is. I'm actually gonna. I don't have anything to pick it with, so that's just useless. Um, and what it does, what I can use it for, because if it is beneficial, I'll definitely be on the lookout for more of those. But if not, then I'll just leave it to where they are. But guys, episode 4. Um, again, I apologize for not posting uh, the last few days or week or two weeks or whatever how long it was. Um, again, ooh, what is that? Chimp Chomp has just earned the achievement. Time to mine. Chimp Chomp has just earned the achievement getting on upgrade getting an upgrade excuse my english is is, is no bueno um but yeah awesome achievements uh i should just do this right speed things up and then whoops i didn't mean to put a door there i don't know what the hell the door is gonna do for us just trying to get gather as many of these as i can so i wouldn't have to worry about um I could, I could get rid of that. Get rid of you too. Get rid of you. Or did I just get rid of you? You. Um, dirt. I'm not really gonna need that. And then pick some stuff up. Actually, I'm just gonna put. I'm just gonna put some stuff in the chest. So we can. Like, like, what am I doing with these two doors down here? Um, what else? What else can I put away? I don't need these seeds. Don't need this gate. Um, don't need this wool right now. Actually, I need to take that back upstairs. But other than that, guys, I hope you enjoyed episode four. I mean, episode three. Excuse me. Uh, we'll be back on more episodes this week, so stay tuned for that. I'm your host, Jim Chop, and thank you so much for watching. Holy crud! It's nighttime already. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.